Yo, what's up, man? I just want to share with you guys an awesome thought of the day I just had today. Yeah, that's why I'm so freaking just pumped up, because it just gave me so much energy back. It was just a little mind shift, and I just definitely was just excited to, ch to share with you guys right now. So I just asked myself why I'm afraid of having a discussion with other people. I'm not meaning a just neutral discussion, I really mean a freaking <laughs> fight, <laughs> an argument with, an, with another person. I'm really afraid of just questioning everything, yes? So at first I asked myself, why do people think or why do I think that having an argument with another person is something bad or something you shouldn't have normally, yes? That's the first question. And then I just just came to my mind I that I may be just afraid of getting feeling rejected or feeling bad afterwards and so on and so on or feeling hurt but then I just thought at the end of the day if I just share honestly my opinion for example with another person and he or she really disagrees with it and yeah share his or her opinion with me and then I feel maybe hurt and I'm afraid of that but at the end of the day the other people can't really hurt me because it's just it's just their opinion for me I have a Pretty awesome picture, Matt. Just imagine you have headphones on your ears, over your ears, and you just look at the other person getting like all over his face, angry facial expressions, like but you just can't hear anything. So for me it would be a great advice. Maybe you guys want to try it out, just to be really calm and just try to kind of meditate when you have your next argument argument, and just observe the other person because it has nothing to do with you it just tells you everything about the other person for example for example what she likes what she don't likes or uh, what what she values the most in her life and so on and so on but it doesn't really have to do with something with you that's the first thing i i just realized again and the next thing which is really important is what what i already shared in another video and what i discovered through meditation is that your emotions and your thoughts are not yourself so just ask yourself who am I who is the I and who is the person or the yeah the person inside who just observes those changes in the mood in your emotions or your, you can look or observe your thoughts there's the I inside which never ever becomes the emotions or become becomes the thought and just is there whatever so even I, I think that's pretty powerful and you can really feel it if you meditate a lot and just observe everything but for example just imagine uh, the, you have a person uh, you have an argument with another person and she or he is hurts you. They can't really hurt you, but just for the example, they hurt you, but then you just have a new emotion in your body and maybe th some thoughts running around. 
So maybe, oh, the other person is so bad to me, or oh, I feel so shitty right now, whatever. But maybe an hour later it will already begun, or you can do different techniques, what I will share in another video, of course, how you can let go of those emotions, how you can handle those emotions, or how you just can reframe your thoughts in a positive way, and so on. So at the end of the day, that was pretty a aha moment because I just thought, yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter if an argument is something bad or something good. For me, I just find the solution that in the next situation, if I think or if I think deep inside and having an argument would be maybe something where we can benefit both from, then I just have an argument and if it's not the case then I just don't. So and then I can imagine that guys for, for, a, for a moment. What is if you could share anything, be as vulnerable, as open as possible because no one out there can hurt you anymore. No one, because it tells you just something about the other person. Just have the picture in your head, you have headphones on your ears, you just look at the other person and receive all the information, what they like, how they <laughs> change their face expressions and what they value the most and so on and so on. But it, they can't look inside yourself, they can't change anything inside yourself and even if the, if you let them hurt you, they can't hurt you, but you can let them hurt you. At the end of the day, you hurt, you st hurt yourself if you think bad about yourself after the argument. But even then, you can just start meditating or use any technique out of my other videos. And you can quickly just yeah accept those emotions, just let go and a few minutes or even hours later you will feel pretty good again so that's pretty freeing or not I thought yeah man fuck yeah so I can just share as openly as I want and say whatever I want and go in any freaking discussion I don't mean just to have an argument with just have an argument with any person you know but for me it's not like, oh you have to be nice, or you have to look after your words. But just just connect with your inner voice, with your, with your heart, whatever you want to call your inside. Your, your inner knowing, your inner intuition. And just share and just live your life to the fullest man. And just give a big thumbs up if you like the video, if you like the thought of the day. If you want to, me sharing more often my crazy thoughts of the days and we we'll see us in the next views have a nice day stay sexy stay positive Blah! oh